Hello, this is Jason with Agline Co-op in Delmont, South Dakota. Out in the cornfield today, taking a look at some issues that I want to pass along to growers on something that maybe need to be looking at here coming up before harvest or here real shortly. Um, out in this particular field, of course, we know we have a lot of pollination issues with the drought and uh, the heat that we've had. But also another thing I'm seeing a lot of is the butt of the ear. We did not get very good pollination. So what's happening is we're getting really weak shanks and that one broke off real easily you know and unfortunately looking at this corn we're probably a quarter to third milk line so we're still a couple weeks away yet from black layer to full maturity um, looking down this row you can see all of the ears that are already starting to drop um, because of the lack of integrity in the ear shank now there could be there's a lot of issues that cause this of course the biggest thing is the drought and the heat stress that we have another thing to look at maybe is if you have blocks or sections of refuge corn where we could have some corn bore issues boring into the shank i don't see any out here um, this is refuge in a bag corn so i i haven't located any corn bore issues in the shank but unfortunately you know, our yields are going to be down this year, but I think we're going to have to get this corn out early. If we have a wind event like we had last year, a lot of this corn is going to end up on the ground because it's really starting to hang. And if we get up here and take a you know, yank on it, it snaps off pretty easily. It does not take much to break it off. So unfortunately, we get some wind, and it's going to be on the ground. So just another thing to take a look at out in the field, if you want to... Um, give us a call at Agline Co-op in Delmont, ask us some questions. We're more than willing to help you out as best we can. Again, this is Jason with Agline Co-op. Thank you.